Hi guys, how y'all doing today? Welcome to the Gucci Card Cooking Show. Today I'll be cooking. Uh, we're gonna be cooking. I think these are duck and crab legs. And we're gonna be cooking a uh, cold lobster. Uh, cook and pre cooked claws and arms. Things I'm cooking, I will be making my own li uh, lemon butter. Just tune in. Alright. So, now, we want to get started to our pocket. I got a crock pot, so we're going to start with this crock pot because we got to make sure these come out very correctly. So we're going to get a crock pot. So, um, what's up, the wild ass one? What's up, Kevin? So, so today we're actually going to be cooking. Corn, shrimp, and my cheese, crabs, and lobster. So if y'all want to tune in, tune in, please tune in. It's time for Welcome to Gucci Carter's Cooking Show. It is back. We in process, y'all. So um, Facebook actually asked me to do a cooking show of lobster, shrimp, and my famous lemon butter. I'll be cooking tonight. Okay. So, ladies, um, let's get the ingredients down. Get your pens and paper, turn on the TV. Put me on the TV so y'all can get intimate with this. Welcome to the Gucci Carter's Cooking Show. I'm Gucci Carter, and I'm the cooking show producer. So, so um, tune in, y'all. Oh, thank you. Oh, these are my Valentine's nails. Um, so what we gonna get started with? We gonna uh, we already set out the crock pot as y'all see. As I'm giving y'all directions. We already got the crock pot out, already ready to so ready to go. Actually, um, so we are gonna move over here to another thing. We got our corn. We're gonna have to do our corn, y'all. Um, we have lemon juice. Um, now I got a new seasoning for the lemon butter. Uh, we're gonna be using Mrs. Dash, and I got the lemon pepper seasoning uh, from King S. Ford. It's another one for the lemon pepper butter, and my favorite to season my. Um, crab is I got smoked hickory seasoning for my crab so um I'm trying to come on come in with me welcome to the Gucci Carta cooking show I know y'all miss my cooking so why not to come in tonight enjoying the crowd the positivity we got going come on guys I'm I'm still the same person I'm just a different person in a different way guys y'all really think I'm out to bite y'all I mean, I want some support, y'all. If y'all Gucci gang, support Gucci gang. Come on, get on here. Yes, I miss this show. Bye. B. All right, so I need y'all to tune in. Gather other people. Uh, this is live. This is public. This is in my own home. So, um, so I'm, I'm doing some new stuff. So, with a lot of things. Thank y'all. Um, so, you know, I had a choice because Facebook wanted me to do, um, I was thinking about putting some shrimp with this. Hi, y'all. Hi. So, ladies, I need y'all, I need y'all to eat y'all a pen and piece of paper, Okay. Just let me know y'all got y'all shit ready because this is a whole new different scenario. Now we used to cook with king lobster, right? We did blue snow crab before, right? And then we have done 
I think lobster tails. We have done a lot of that, right? In the beginning of the time of the first season of the Gucci Cardi show. We are on season 23, guys. The new spirituality. Now we're coming back to the cooking shit, y'all. I know y'all been missing my cooking show so bad. And I, and I dedicate this to my fans that who loves my cooking. So this is a whole new different type of recipe. So I need y'all to get down your pens and piece of papers. Write this recipe down. And let's do this shit. You know what I'm saying? Uh, if y'all don't know how many measures, how many teaspoons, I'm going to give that to y'all once we get started. So, I want everybody to start joining in. Y'all go share. Share, share, share. That's why I want y'all to do share, share, share. Come in. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Welcome to the Gucci Cardi Show. Welcome, everybody. I am back with the Gucci Cardi Show. Today, we're going to be cooking a lot of things. And I want everybody to say hi to each other on my shows. Congratulations to a lot of things that we overcome ourselves and positivity. Uh, we are here to learn and learn. Okay. So, the first one we got wild caught Durango crab legs cooked and all natural. Okay. This is what we have here. Okay. We have these. So, yes, y'all are on my cooking show. This is a reality TV show, the real thing, not the just because you see something. No, this is a real reality TV show about my life. This is something that I take. This is something that I platform behind. This is something that I mutually be in. I do a lot of similar reading. So we're going to see how big these are. Let's see. Okay. Now. Yeah. These are pretty big. So, yeah. So, we got a couple of these. Um, let's see. The biggest one. So, yeah. So, these are pre handed. So, as we see. Then we got the motherfucking lobster. Y'all know we can't get it twisted with the motherfucking lobster. The lobster is what the lobster is. And then, uh, I'm going to be doing some corn with it. So, the corn will be cooked on a different side of the lobster because I got to use marinade seasonings for this. So, now, when y'all start cooking, okay, so, I have, you need about three bottles of water. Okay, just start this off. I'm gonna turn my camera on so y'all can actually see what's going on. Um, so y'all want to be so in line. Um, just listening to me. So I'm gonna turn the camera over so y'all can actually see what I'm actually doing. Okay, so we got three waters. Okay. Hold on, y'all. I'm gonna open this snap. All right, so I'm gonna try to fix it. Can y'all see it? Okay. Now we're adding three cups of water, three bottles of water, because you want to add this all the way around. Now I think three would be enough, but we just want to be sure. So three bottles of water. Three bottles of water, guys. Alright, so when I was telling y'all the seasonings that I am going to be using will be the smoked maple seasoning with pepper, regular black pepper, and we have my favorite honey garlic, uh, honey garlic. Pepper, and we're gonna use. Uh, let me see what I use. Uh, I think that's all you gotta use. Okay. So when I use this, I use most of the time I use like a quarter pound or a teaspoon inside of my water. Okay. 
Now what you say? Where is the Ab Abdu Boo? What the fuck? Speak English. This is called Honey Rub Barbecue, which I usually add about three teaspoons. Which if I do a spread across, it's gonna that's gonna be three teaspoons across. Okay. My smoke. Now my hickory smoke. I just use a dash of teaspoon of this. I just glaze it for the taste. Pepper. Just smooth it over to the top. Okay. Peppers gives it, 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 just smooth it. Just drag it like that. Um, and then I'm going to be using my smoke, um, smoke mesquite. Um, now, okay, so, look. I don't like people on my show getting up on here. Because hashtag, hashtag grounded still does remain on, on this page. So if you want to get blocked, I remind you to stop what you're doing because I ain't doing shit to you. And I don't think you really want to get me there. So don't get on here. I know a lot of people. Um, I don't use them, okay? Um, a lot of people know who I am. In a totally different way. But don't get it fucked up real quick. Because I can delete your bitch ass off my page. With no problem. Anybody else want to see this show? All eight of these people up here want to see this show? Pee on your best conduct please. I'm going to put you on your ass. Period. I don't play no games. When it comes to cooking. Because a lot of people really want to learn how to cook. And I'm here to teach them. So give them a fucking chance. Instead of y'all always laughing about something. What is so funny? When somebody's giving y'all instructions how to fucking cook. Please come on. Please let me know. Do y'all want to learn this new recipe I have? Or I could get off this motherfucker and don't show nobody this new recipe. Out of my new recipe book that I'm typing up for y'all. Y'all got the Versace pizza. Y'all got the Brazilian tacos. Y'all got y'all even got Gucci's Mabel Bacon Burger in it. Come on, y'all. Let's come on. Let's join in. Come on. This is a new way that I'm teaching you how to cook seafood. I'm a vegetarian. I don't eat all that shit y'all think I eat. You know how to keep your body. Look, wait a minute. I know there's a. Let me just tell you this. To learn how to burn body fat from your stomach, not to get fupa, to learn how to get it all flat, let me teach you something. You may learn from me. It may help you in the long run. Because when you don't learn about things, how would you know instructions, right? A lot of women want to lose have a flat stomach, right? A lot of um, women want to lose the fat off their stomach. I do. I want to look sexy. I like to look big and thick too. So, you know what I'm saying? I just, you know, uh, she said, is that seasoning since mostly used Mexican food? Okay, April Garcia. No, this is black people seasoning, honey. This is a mist look, smoky mesquite seasoning. This is what this is, nigga seasoning. We call this nigga seasoning. Okay? But I'm teaching, so I'm teaching y'all ladies. And gentlemen, to how to burn fat. And this is, these are for real, for real. These are facts. I'm not here to argue with people. I'm, I just want people to learn. I mean, what's so hard for somebody to teach certain women that don't know how to cook to actually watch my show and learn how to cook? Okay? Now, on this right here, my mesquite, I do it twice across. As I was showing y'all before somebody got on here and started laughing. Um, yes, this is nigga seasoning. Yes, we're going to call this nigga seasoning. The mesquite is my favorite because it gives you all the flavors. This is called the nigga seasoning, okay? The nigga seasoning. So, if, if, if I'm like humorous with y'all and, and we want to have a positive vibe and goof off, I just need y'all to remain positive, you know what I mean? 
And that's some shit to laugh about. Nigga seasoning. This one, that's hilarious. That's something to laugh about. You see what I'm saying? Being humorous is being a being who you are. Authentic. So, I'm still the same person, guys. I just have a different mind frame. That's it. I just became more mature in my age. That's it. I'm growing up. I'm not a kid. I'm a woman. I'm, I got to be a grown up about what I do in this life. It's about change, y'all. So, this is called nigga seasoning. So, when you get your nigga seasoning, you're going to put them motherfucking nigga seasoning across this motherfucker like you supposed to nigga season this motherfucking shit. See, you know what I'm talking about. Be on that pedestal queen shit. Fuck a nigga. <laughs> Tell you that. Even though I'm a um, miracle woman. Yeah. Um, Alright, so let's get, let's get to it. So, we got our nigga seasoning right here, guys. And we're going to take the nigga seasoning. We're going to spread this motherfucker across. So I'm going to flip it over for y'all. Before we put the lobster in. Now, y'all see this? It's already preheating. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to add my nigga seasoning. And I'm going to put my nigga seasoning in it. You know what I'm talking about? Then you take that nigga seasoning. Yeah, I'm going to mix it so I can mix all my seasonings together. Okay. You're going to do it just like this. Mix that good old nigga juice. Yes, please take note. All right, so you're going to whip this motherfucker like it's a seasoning, right? Put this on my toaster. Okay, can y'all see what's exactly going on? Okay, hold on. Let me take it out of my filter thing. Okay. Yes, I'm cooking, y'all. Yes. I don't know why this thing ain't up. Okay. Can y'all see me? I think I'm shining too bright for y'all. Okay, so we got it. This is the nigga juice. You know what I'm talking about? And gravity, when you cook this food right here, you're going to mix this nigga juice. It's called some nigga seasoning juice. You know what I'm talking about? Nigga seasoning juice. You're going to mix it. Tell the court before you add your lobster all up in that shit. For real. Now, they may not tell you what the fuck is going on. Oh, thank you. So, we want to do these lobsters like the way they're supposed to do these lobsters. And I know y'all love my show so we're going to start putting in the lobster inside the, uh, the nigga juice. So you're going to get these. You're going to... Uh, let me turn my camera so y'all can actually see what I'm about to do. So y'all can get the um, shit in. Alright. Now. Alright. So, Alright. Yo. Okay. So... Let me show y'all something. So, this is called the, the nigga juice. This is a nigga juice. So, we're going to put, we're going to place these in here. Okay. Just what we're going to do, guys. Y'all see how big these motherfuckers is? All right. This definitely is the inner inner niggas right now. Now, y'all see how is, this is steaming? Do y'all see how this nigga juice going? This is the nigga juice. All right, y'all see that? Hold on. All right. Now, what we putting in it is the lobster. We putting in lobster. 
Look, sweetie. We don't look, sweetie. Let me tell y'all something. Anything that I cook, look, let me tell you something. This is what I learned in my own kitchen. When I cook my food, I put them in clean water after. Then what I do, I'll take what I do, right? What I when I see when I when I see I clean lobster. Now the other one said they already if the bag already said all natural pre clean, see these are already being cleaned from the bag. So if I buy a bag that says it's already being pre cleaned, I don't have to clean them. You see what I'm saying? This bag says it's been pre cleaned, pre cooked. I buy lobster that's fresh, that's already clean and cooked. Okay. Now I call it the nigga juice because I came with my own style, man. The niggas making lemon crowds for the local wine and blackmail. Lobster, it was splash bad and what the hell, bougie? What's bougie, Kevin? You bougie? My show's on fleek. Okay, so and and I'm and the reason why I want to tell you that because um a lot of people let me tell y'all something my light is shining so bright right now. Let me tell y'all something. When y'all buy bags, make sure y'all look on the logo that says pre cleaned lobster. That means they already cleaned the lobster. So if the lobster is already in the package, already already frozen because I had ordered this and it's already been pre cleaned and already put it in the package for me. So when I order my lobster, it's already pre cleaned. It's already clean as a whistle. So you don't have to worry about it. Now, if you bought crabs from like from the deli, it's not clean. That's the type that you gotta rinse. Now I've been eating seafood from for three years straight, and I lost all a lot of weight. So now you may not can afford lobster. You can. They're only twenty bucks for a whole bag. If you wanted to know that, what's your name? Miss Sanders? Well, there you go, Miss Sanders. And there's nothing wrong to know that. You feel me? So, um, we have the lobster's legs. Do y'all want me to, do y'all want to see me put them in here? Let's do that. So y'all can, uh, get on here so we could, you know, have some fun, you know? All right, so, hey, so we putting these in here, okay, in the nigga juice, we're going to call this the nigga juice, I'm cooking. Alright, so. Alright, so. Alright, so. We got our lobster in here. In the nigga juice. We got the lobster in the nigga juice, y'all. So, what I'm gonna do next. Is let it sit, pre sit. So, this sorry about that, guys, but this right here is the nigga juice Gucci crabs. Okay, we're gonna call this the nigga juice because I did make some homemade nigga juice for the crabs. You know what I'm talking about? So, what we're gonna do as we see here, guys. We don't love that good cooking, you know what I'm saying? Hey, damn. She doing too much, man. So, now. Now, you gotta let these cook. You gotta let them steam sit. 
Put that up, put that away. Throw the package away. Now. Alright, so I'm gonna wash my hands. Very good, my nerves. Like, like, I'm doing other shit. Yeah, hold on. I gotta see. Um, no, I don't live in Texas anymore. I live in Atlanta, Georgia. Guys, I'm back. Um, so the next thing we're gonna do, we're gonna do the corn. Now, now I don't do my, I do my corn a little separate from my lobster, is because I eat weird. And then we're gonna get started on the lemon butter. Um, so baby, how many corns you want? Two. All right. So, can y'all see me? Can y'all see me good enough? Okay. So, now my corn. I do rinse off my corn. And these some big ass corns, you know what I'm saying? That corn on the cob. Corn on the cob, extra brunch. Real good, huh? Now, I'm cooking about four corns for both of us. And then I'm going to put the rest in the freezer. Now, when I do my corn, okay? I use my sugar. Sugar. I love sugar and butter. Can't never go wrong with it. Okay. Okay. Let me show y'all what it, what I'm exactly what I'm about to do. I don't know what's. Okay, so this is my butter now I'm about to come over and add um what am I this? I'm gonna add my water. Okay. I'm gonna sit them on the stove like this. Then what I'm gonna do is, is this is my favorite butter. I can't believe it's not butter. Okay? I can't believe this shit is not butter. Now, my stove is on. I do use country butter sometimes. Okay? Now, I'm going to flip it over for y'all. So y'all know exactly this is like coronary is me, but yes, um, I know it ain't more like butter, but all right. So what I do, I I get some butter. I don't I'm I don't eat meat. I don't eat fish, lobster, and shrimp. Okay, that's butter. Add in butter, and then I add my honey. Okay, and when I go around with my honey, I'll take one, two, three, four, five, 
and then I'll do it one more time. Okay. And then I'll leave it there. See how this is turning out? Very good. So, once I get that done, then I add what I do. I add my pico de gallo. Okay. So, y'all see that? That coming out pretty. So, what I do, I grab this, and then I add my pico de gallo, and let that pico de gallo marinate on the top. Okay. Then, it just becomes... Understand? I'm gonna do one more. So it could all be around just like that. Okay. Good marination. Good eating. Good vegetable. Okay. Okay. And so what I'm gonna be adding is a liquid roll. This is the nigga juice. And then I'm taking my my uh Soraya rub and I'm just gonna rub it on on top of it. Just fuck like that, y'all. Just fuck like that. Yeah. Get all up in it. Like that shit, y'all. Mm. Yeah, look that bitch look delicious, darling. it. When you put love in your motherfucking food, you put love in your dish. You know what I'm talking about? Ooh, that's a delicious donut, everybody. Mmm. Now, we're gonna close it up. Y'all, that y'all making y'all hungry, y'all know. So, when you know that your food is cooking, you wanna put love in your food. Alright? A lot of people, um, don't put love in their food. They just cook to be cooked. So, ladies, if y'all in the kitchen, please show some love in your cooking. Because it's like the more love you put in your cooking, the more that shit tastes right. When you don't put love in your kit, when you don't put love in your food, right? Uh, and, and, and I say this, if you don't put love in your food, then it's not going to taste like love. It's going to taste like your energy. So when your energy positive, your food come out good. You know what I'm saying? And it, it, it's, it's not being an asshole about it. It's really not. And um, so, you know, it's the package like me. No, the packages, you could get it at Walmart. It just says crab or lobster lid packages, Miss uh, Sanders. Okay? Sorry about that, guys. Sorry about that, guys. Um... So, the next one I'm going to be putting, okay, so the next thing we going to be doing is our lemon butter. Now, lemon butter, guys, I want y'all to understand what lemon butter is. Now, lemon butter is based off on, okay, the lemon butter is... So we're gonna get over here. Alright, so let's try this. It's a lot better right now. I'm gonna know my lights are bright. Alright, so 
Okay, so to make lemon butter, okay? You need lemon juice. I'm using a new Mrs. Dash lemon. And then I'm using lemon pepper, all seasoning, and cypress. Okay. I'm going to get that. Uh -oh. I'm gonna try to see this. Hold on. You know what? Let me wash that inside real quick. Let me wash my dishes real quick. I always want to fail before you do a lot of shit. Before you do shit. Let's get started. Any questions? How to do some things, ladies? Any questions? Got me any questions to ask? How to make the lemon butter? So, let's get started on this part where we make our homemade lemon butter. So, I want y'all to see. Yeah, 
All right. So, and not lemon butter. We need a little bit more butter. It's not going to have a little bit more butter. So, I'm going to pour this in here. Okay. Yes, I got a question, baby. It is half out loud. It's the same question about the same thing. You talking about the nigga juice or the lemon pepper? This. So, I'm going to put the rest of my butter in here. We got just a quarter a dab on the butter. So, y'all know a real nigga got to have a country butter, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Um, what's the same question, April Garcia? What's the same question that you need to ask? What's the same question? Just re ask at the bottom. Welcome, wheelchair wheel. Okay. Welcome to the Gucci Car Show. All the new people that joined this, this completely reality TV show live. Thank y'all for choosing Gucci Carter Cooking Show. Welcome to Season 23, Episode 23. So, do we are still in Season 2. Uh, we just on Episode 23. Um, welcome, join. Um, I'm more. Yeah. What's up, y'all? So, um, we're making lemon pepper, um, lemon pepper butter. We're using different things. Um, we're not gonna get started with that, okay? The new guy. Um, no, laugh out loud. I heard you say, baby. Uh, is that a new guy? I remember the last time we talked? Um, yeah, I that's. That's my business. Okay. Um, that's on a, that's on when we talk. April. Because we, we've grown women about that situation. Um, you talking about a new guy. Um, you mean my new husband? Uh, yeah. You mean my husband, that's what you mean. Now, the reason why I want to lean better because we eat no I'm just a little shrimp. You know how people like to go back and say this to the divine masculine. Doing all types of shit. Yeah, so Hold on, y'all. I gotta see what my hair is. Baby, just. She's just bucking me. Wow. 
God, I'm like, dude, she's like really bugging me about some shit that I don't even. Okay, you're like blowing on my phone crazy. Uh, number two, I just told you that once I get paid, I will deal with that issue when I need to. And the thing about you blowing up my phone crazy, and I just talked to you last night, girl. I'm tired. I'm on my reality TV show. You interrupted my show by texting me crazy. What is, what's wrong with you, see? I know what I said, but damn, you rushing me like, I gotta just demand to do any the fucking thing I want. You my bitch, remember that. Anyways, um. <laughs> Good to you cooking, for real, y'all. What we have here is our cocktail shrimp. And I like these because I eat shrimp raw too. So. But I don't want a real shrimp in my mouth. Okay. So. okay. So we're adding our shrimp. So what we gonna do, we're gonna add just a little bit more butter. Okay, well, I work Monday through Friday, 6 p.m. all the way to 3 o'clock p.m. Work schedule. Yeah, my girlfriend going crazy. Yeah, babe, I'm fine. Okay. I have my lemon border halfway, as y'all see. 
You want to take a good stir mix. Now, when I add my lemon juice, I add my lemon juice. One, two, three, four. Okay. Mix. Left mix, not right. Counterize. Left counterize. You want to mix it left, not right. Left. It's a difference. Oh. And when you, when you hear your lips smack, that means you got it right. Okay. All right. And then what I'll do, my nails is long. All right. So when I take my lemon, I just sprinkle it all the way around. Just put enough in there to make you feel like you got that lemon good ass tape. Like that bitch gonna go wrong, right? Yeah, my girlfriend keep on my ass up. I mean, I gotta be ten years. This is my wife. I'm his wife, so. so. Yeah. I know my love, I know you gonna get done with these cards so you keep your words. I just wondering. Uh you need to do your part because we gotta launch out this project by the end. Uh, before, I think after the 16th. Yeah, that's, that's probably the day I will get there. But you need to come with your half, and I'll come with the other half. That's how that's supposed to work. Fair and fair. Fair. Alright, so guys, yes, I am launching out a project that's coming up very soon. It will be products that uh, to go with my uh, spiritual business. Now my recipe book is almost done. I've been working on it. So, um, yes. So when you mix this, you want to do this. You don't want to add too much of it. Okay. You want to just mix it so according to the mix. But y'all know me. I like to taste my shit. Perfect though. And you want to do a left hand around. Then after you do that, what you're going to do is pick this right back in the microwave for another two minutes. Let it sit there and get hot before you go up to your lobster. So, then it's like this is a new lemon pepper, real lemon pepper butter that I make. And a lot of people have made it before and they say this shit's on fleek, I know. You know what I'm talking about? Mm -mm -mm. <sighs> All right, so. No, y'all ready? Y'all better just see this shit. We're gonna get our pan. Y'all see it? Okay. Now, which I got started doing it. Gonna start taking it out. Y'all see that? It's it's real, real lobster. So, um, this is real. 
I'm gonna set this here so y'all can actually see me reload it in. I gotta use my fingers for this shit. Make sure you get all the shrimp. I'm just gonna sit, put some of this over here so it don't dry.
So if y'all look at it. Then you can take the chart in there now. So, and that's what y'all call a feast. 